hi guys welcome back to my channel thank you so much for coming to join me for another video and welcome if you are new to my channel i am going to be so in today's video i'm going to be redistributing my money from fill the jar and then adding a new addition into my binders as well so fill the jar we completed this in my last cash stuffing video if you haven't already seen that pop over and have a look it was a good video there was a lot going on so we should have 120 pounds here we've got 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 80 85 90 95 1 5 10 15 and 20 so this 120 pound um i am going to put 100 of it to christmas and then i'm going to put the rest so the other 20 in sinking funds so yeah i think i chose this to give christmas a little bit of a boost up because i want to save a thousand pounds for christmas so what i'm gonna do is we'll get the 100 so 10 20 30 40 50 60 70 85 95 and one okay so we're gonna pop this 100 straight into christmas which is very satisfying let's get my green pen okay so we can colour in two and a half stockings so one two. I hope everybody's doing well hope everyone's had a lovely weekend I had a really nice weekend actually um, I've done quite a few things there was bowling on Friday night I stood at my boyfriend's and then I was out for lunch on Saturday and then at a family friend's barbecue and then just home and getting bits and bobs done today. So yeah, it's been nice. Okay, so for Christmas we have got £250 in Monzo, um, to 70 90 I'm going to do that so 320 30 40 50 60 70 80 90 400 and 5 10 15 20 420 pounds that's amazing that was a nice boost that we've given that so i will need to condense this down is that right 40 right one two three four five so two four hundred and twenty yeah perfect so we are almost halfway there in my christmas savings which is fabulous okay so pop this one back in and my we'll clean it off and put that back in for the next round of fill the jar as well so sinking funds so 20 pounds for sinking funds um i don't really know where this is going to go sorry i hope that didn't cut off there tell me i've got a low battery um i'm just going to have a little look and see where i'm needing money so um let's have a look i took i got my windows clean today so i took from home maintenance home bits is okay mm, clothing could do the beauty fun okay so i am going to split it between fun and clothing because those two areas are needing money so we're going to pop 10 pounds into fun which now has 20 40 60 5 and 70. i swear the same 10 pound has been coming in and out of here for days as you'll see so took out 20 put in 40 took out put in 20 took out 20 put in 20 and then we've just taken out 20 yesterday for my little day out <laughs> so let me grab a pen so then um, right so we took out 20 so it was down to 60 and then we added 10 so it's now up at 70 perfect and then 10 pounds will go into clothing as well because i'm trying to save up for some new clothes that actually fit me so clothing now has 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 85, 95, and 1. £100 in clothing. 
So that's that. That is very good. Okay, so I'm going to clean off this tracker and just pop it back in to use again because I would really like to do it again. I absolutely love this challenge. Um, I just love all the colours and the mystery of it. <laughs> this is really good. And there we go. So that's cleaned up for the next one. Um, I'm going to wipe off what it's going towards because I don't know yet. You may have seen on my Instagram that I booked another holiday today. <laughs> so my partner and I, um, I booked us the £99 voucher mystery holiday. Sorry, I could hear something outside. Yeah, so I booked the £99 voucher mystery holiday and we are going to Lake Garda in Italy in February, which is so good. I'm so excited. So I'm obviously going to have to start saving for that. So might use this to go towards that, but we will see. So we could pop this back into challenges and start that afresh. Now, you might see at the side of me here that I have an autumn challenge sitting there. What I'm going to do with this is I would really like to get a pair of um, Doc Martin Chelsea boots for autumn and winter. So, obviously, something that's going to be long-lasting, something I could get the wear out of. I have got... Um, Doc Martin boots that are the sort of chunky lace-up ones and they've lasted me so so long so yes I would love to invest in a pair but obviously they're expensive and I don't just have £200 to spend so we are going to use this autumn challenge which saves £100 um, so obviously I'm going to have to do it twice but each um, symbol will be worth £10 and it'll save 100 and then we'll clean it off and we'll do it again and then we'll have the money for my Doc Martens. So what I'm hopefully going to do is use some vintage money for that. So I have sold a couple of pairs of shoes on vintage recently so I am thinking of just taking that money out and popping it straight into there um, just to kind of start that and then I'll just have a look and see if there's anything else that I could sell um, just along the way. So we'll pop that one in there. There we go. So I do have a couple of categories. I'm wanting to change some of these envelopes around. Um, I do have a couple of categories that I want to kind of change up a little bit. So my, my beauty fund envelope, I would like this to be um, like beauty and self care. And then I would like to also have another fund that's for, like if I'm needing new mascara, new foundation, that sort of thing. And then the, the beauty and self-care, or maybe just self-care, I don't know, that'll be for beauty treatments that I want to treat myself to. So yeah, I am going to change these up slightly. Um, I've got health, but I think I'm going to change that to health and well-being because I buy supplements like protein supplements and multivitamins and stuff like that. So that will come from there. And what other ones? Yeah, I think that was it. Um, obviously, we've added in my one for my shoes. We have got a garden one, which I haven't put anything in. Date night, which again, not put anything in. Um, Chris Stapleton, I am going to in October. So I think I just need, uh, I think £10 in that completes it. Um, home essentials, that's actually in my purse. Um, home maintenance was a target of mine's to build up, but I'm kind of having second thoughts about it just now. We've got £70 in there just now. But with all these holidays I'm going on, I might need to just change my priorities a little bit. Which is okay because that's 
what happens it's personal finance and that is personal to me and i love going on holiday so yes that is me for today guys short and sweet thank you so much for coming to watch my video and um, thank you so much if you stayed till the end to listen to my little update and if you don't already subscribe to me please consider subscribing um, or following me over on Instagram. I, I document a lot of my journey on there as well and I'm hopefully going to keep everything updated with my voucher mystery holiday because a lot of people are actually quite in, um, intrigued and excited to see how that goes. So yes, I will pop up for now and I will see you all very, very soon. Bye!